Have a Hey, at least he won't fall over in the spa, though. Hey, Dan. Hey. <laughs> Not ready to remember that. Bye. Yeah, I mean, speaking of going outside, though, you had an interesting experience, didn't you, in a certain spa? <laughs> Are you... Just asking me to say this because I made you tell well, the news story. Okay, well, it was fine, like, oh, should I go outside? Here's the reason why not. So when we were in Hong Kong, we had a couple days on the way to Australia. Hong Kong, it was a fun place. Obviously, yep. flopped to getting a far fetched. We all know that. <laughs> Sweaty Dan, it was a fun day. Um, I decided to go to a spa. Phil was like, no, that's really awkward. Why the heck would I do that? And I was I've like, had... no, no, I deserve some relaxation. Yeah. And it was like a Tuesday in the middle of the day, so I thought it'd be empty and it'd be fine. And it was most of the time, so I was just walking around, I was having like a cheeky steam, I was listening cheeky to some steam. music, and then I saw the sauna, and I was like, thank God this place is abandoned, it's not awkward. So I go in, I sit down, and then I notice that some guys just sat there opposite me, and I'm like, oh, oh my God, no, this guy is going to make small talk with me. Just and you and him. I'm, I'm sat in a towel with no <laughs> clothes on, and this guy is going to... People in the comments are going to judge you for screaming that. I'm just saying that. Okay. Uh, and obviously, he started talking to me like, so uh, what brings you to Hong Kong? And I was like, ah! No, social interaction. No, this is why I literally don't go outside. Why is this happening? So I just started thinking the whole time. I need to plan my out. I'm going to think of a sentence to drop. And then as soon as the time is right, I'm going to leave. So I was sat there, I was sat there. And I was like, okay, the time has come. And all I was thinking of was... I'm going to say this, and then I'm going to leave, and then I'm going to go back to the hotel room, and it's not going to be awkward. So I was like, ha, huh, yeah, the weather is pretty good. I got up, started power marching. But because I was just steaming, I left some wet footprints on the floor. <laughs> and as I was power walking out of the door, I slipped on my own footprint. <laughs> I slipped, and this, this wasn't like a casual thing. It was like a hard fall, okay, onto the floor. <laughs> like, I, like, my entire body cleared, and then I did like a from three foot, like belly flop onto the thing. Ouch. Dropping my towel in front of this <laughs> random man. So I was just like fully exp and this wasn't attractive. Like, I didn't get, I was like a dying giraffe. Just like struggling <laughs> Dying on the giraffe. floor. It was a complete mess. And I was like, ah, sorry. But and he was just like, are you, are you okay? Like, and I was like, yeah, I'm f I wasn't fine. I was in incredible pain. I was like, everything's fine. Okay, bye. And then I just left and basically cried myself to sleep. Thank you oh. for making me well, share that, Phil. <laughs> I think there it was worth sharing. That's good. All right. <laughs>